What's good, everyone? It's your homie Hermit. We're back into Bungle. Uh, we got Ars Moriendi, I believe. It's gonna be a double reaction. We got this, and then the live version. Uh, I've been loving this journey, dude. It's been crazy, chaotic, beautiful, humorous. <laughs> it's it's been a whole lot of different things. So uh, let's let's just hop into this song and let's see where this one takes us. This one is all fucking over the place. It's like we started in Egypt, now we're in California or some shit. <laughs> I love it. It's like the Beach Boys are about to start saying. <laughs> Taking a stop in Germany, I see. I like it. <laughs> It's just fascinating that it can be this all over the place, but it still sounds good together. If I had to describe this, uh, if I had to describe this song briefly, Nations of the World in an instrumental version of the song.
dude. That that makes me want to like. What goes on inside of his fucking head, bro? That's what I gotta know. Because he like, well, not hit just his in their heads. Because that song was all over the place. I still enjoyed it. I thought it was weird as hell, but I it I you know, I still enjoyed it. It's not something I'd go out and listen, you know, again, but if someone started playing it, I would be like, "Oh shit, I know this song." And I'd, you know, I'd fucking rock my head to it. But it's like I said, it's not one of the songs that I'd like they have so many other really good songs that I've already heard that this isn't one that I would go out and try to show other people. <laughs> you know what I mean? Just because it's all over the place. But I did like it. Swiss <laughs> Honestly, I, I can't lie. If I was in a band like that, I'd I'd be dressing up in costumes for every concert. <laughs> Maybe not Swiss Man. But like Spider-Man and shit like that. I will say that, dude. This, like, the bass in this could be sampled for a hip-hop song. That is something that these guys are filled with. Uh, potential samples. You could you could take the, uh, like, sample their shit and make so many cool hip-hop beats out of it. <laughs> Swiss Miss? I get it now. Like, just after listening to the studio version, I I wouldn't say that I got it. I I get it now because it's uh it's meant to be performed like it's meant to be a live performed song, not a studio listened song. This song you have to see it live and see them having a good time performing it and all that, and it just makes it that much better, in my opinion, in my in my humble opinion. Yeah. <laughs> 
seeing their faces and how happy they were to perform that song made me even more happy to listen to it. Um, it, it just, it was infectious. It was, uh, I had to, I had to <laughs> see it, uh, performed live to get it. Um, let me know which ones I got to check out next, dude. Because just when you don't think you like one of their songs, they take it in a totally opposite direction or you see the live performance and it clicks with you. I, I, I've never, I've never had that experience with another band that makes them unique in that aspect, in that aspect. Um, yeah, just keep keep sending the bungle requests, man. I'm enjoying it. Uh, check us out on Instagram. Say what's up in the Discord. We got a bunch of cool stuff on Patreon, so be sure to check that out. Big shout out to all of the Patreon supporters who have been keeping the content flowing and the quality up and up. And I just can't thank you guys enough. You all rock. Uh, we'll catch you all at the next one. You all have an amazing rest of your day. Peace.